This is part two of making fancy bound buttonholes. When we left our heroine, she had just finished making some really fancy welted squares. And next we're gonna take a trip down to my basement for some ironing. And also my mother has this fancy wooden clapper, so I'm gonna have fun using that, but please realize this is 1000% unnecessary and really extra. The various lips of the welt get ironed all sorts of directions, and if you hate ironing, I'm gonna be honest, you probably shouldn't try bound buttonholes because there's a lot of it involved. Then I basted the holes shut from the front before sewing them in place on the back, trimming the welts down, and then finally cutting and sewing the facing on the inside of the blouse for a nice clean finish. Then all the basting stitches could be removed and here's what they look like. I kind of think they resemble little anuses rather than cute buttonholes, but at least they're really sharp looking anuses. Now I just need to make a decision on what buttons I want to use. 